So now, we're going to be doing a little bit more dangerous one. So we're going to have to do this outside, but we're going to prepare for it first. So basically, we're going to put some vinegar again and some baking soda. And after that, after that, it's going to explode. We're going to put the cap on as fast as possible. And hopefully, this will fly off like a rocket ship. To the moon we shall go. Okay, so let's put the vinegar first. Then. Actually, let's clean this so it doesn't react. So we have, we're going to put also a very small amount of vinegar. So we don't want it to like go crazy, crazy. Just a teeny bit, like, that's probably enough. Then we just need that. Yeah. yeah. So that's, we're probably going to spill a little bit, like, in here. And we got a mini reaction because we tried it later. Let's just put a little bit more. Okay. So now, to, so now what we're going to do, we're going to put a little baking soda in here. Need a small spoon like baby. I'm just gonna put it like that. Yeah, that's probably like just a little like that. And that's probably good. So now let's go outside and test this. So right now my mom is gonna try to do this. Let's go mom. Oh, oh! The cap a little bit flew off, yeah, it did, kinda. But still, it wasn't what we wanted to see. So, last time, it didn't work. And we had this idea, and putting it, the bottle that we used to do, use the balloon, we're gonna see if we can just put a lot more and see if the bottle cap will fly off instead of using the other thing. So let's put a lot of vinegar in here, like, because we want it to put go like all the way to the top so yeah that's about good so let's go outside and we'll also prepare this for it Okay, so now we will do it in the bis this big bottle. So let's start. Best thing about this, we were having more time to see the reaction happen. And yeah, I think the problem here was that we had a very small amount of baking soda. That probably caused it to like not want it to go. Remember that some of the carbon dioxide will also try to push the cap, which is probably the best thing. So yeah, let's go back. Okay, so we decided to change bottles. So let's start. I actually think this might work. Let's see. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, it definitely went out. It's definitely moving a lot. You can see by it. Definitely see that some of it did start moving, but it did not explode. So I'm gonna be showing you how to do this. How, if you want, for example, to make a volcano for like a class project or anything, I'm gonna show you how you can do this very easily with only two ingredients. All you need is baking soda and vinegar. First, you can pour in the vinegar. It doesn't really matter which order, but I suggest to put the vinegar first because baking soda is easier to put in than vinegar is. Let's so actually like, have this here just to make it a little simpler. Okay. So depending on how tall or overall, you won't put that much vinegar. For example, this is short, so I don't have to put too much. And then you just need a spoon, some baking soda, about this much is good. You're just gonna put it in, and then it explodes. And that's a good reaction. The action's good. So that's how you can make your own like small volcano. And goodbye, scientists 
of the world. Bye, and have fun experimenting.